Today we're going to look at how charge can be induced on a conductor by bringing it near an external electric field. So suppose we have this glass rod that's positively charged and we bring it near a metal conductor which is insulated at the base. Well that's going to draw electrons to one side and thereby leave a region of positive charge behind. And if we bring these two conductors into contact now, well that's going to really separate the charge even further. Okay, so the electrons are going to be drawn to one side and the positive charges to the other. And they're all going to be evenly distributed on a surface. And now suppose we take those conductors away from each other so that they are no longer in contact. Well now the conductors are both charged. So basically these conductors have been charged by induction. So another way we can charge a conductor is by grounding it. So if we have this negatively charged rod and we bring it near this conductor, well that's going to repel electrons away this time and leave a region of positive charge. So we have something like this, for example. But of course you're going to have a uniform distribution of charge on the surface of this spherical conductor. And I suppose we've attached this wire to the conductor. So there's a path for these electrons to get even further away from those electrons in the rod. And now if we cut this wire and then remove this rod, so the electrons have no way to get back. And therefore this conductor is going to be positively charged. So that's what we call charge by induction. 